Right now, the city of Las Vegas is on the road to make your drive safer. It's using what is called a mapping vehicle to find what improvements are needed on our roads. Fox says Danny Mastin shows us how it works. This here is the mapping vehicle the city is using to collect its data. They are partnering with a company called Cyclomedia, who supplies the vehicle that uses radar technology and can take 360 photos to see where changes are needed. How can we make sure that we're serving the public to the best of, of our abilities and being able to have that response times that, that will keep traffic moving, keep our citizens uh, aware of what's going on on the roadways. Assistant City Traffic Engineer Joseph Norby tells me it has been over 20 years since the city last took a deep dive into what needs improvement. A lot of our infrastructure ages. You know, we live in a, in a city that sees a lot of sun, and as a result, a lot of our street signs take a beating from the sun, and they fade. Norby says not only does infrastructure age, but things like signs or signals can go missing. The sign could have got knocked down who knows how long ago. Uh, you know, in our records, we're like, I, who knows what was there? We can go back through some imagery uh, captured from this vehicle and go able to say, oh, that was a no parking sign. We need to go get up and get that replaced. In total, the city has 55,000 street lights, 225 school flashers, and 65,000 signs. If we look at some of our signs, and I can't tell if it's a no parking sign or a speed limit sign or a school crossing sign, then, then it really puts our, our other road users in a vulnerable position. Norby tells me the city is using dollars from roadway maintenance funds to complete this project and is expected to get the data back in early 2023. I'm Danny Mastin, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.